Hey, what's up guys? Eric here for Daily Diplomacy, and I wanted to bring you a puzzle today. I am playing a game over here on Backstabber, and I uh, am playing as England here, and I was just uh, able to get into a pretty good position. So I've been working with France and Italy um, versus Germany, and Russia ran into a little bit of issue in the south um, and was able to offer me support um, in the fall. So I'll just show you the fall moves. Uh, he supported me, the Russian, into Denmark. I also supported myself into um, Kiel. Uh, so, so yeah, I, I uh, also <laughs> I also seem to have had a, a build in hand. So uh, looks like I'm going to build three here. So you can see that the Austrian now has just moved and stabbed the Russian. So I'm in a position where I can. I, I, you know, can join in uh, against Russia and probably do pretty well and get it, get over the stalemate line here in, in STP. Um, or I could slowly improve my position against France and work towards uh, the stalemate line in Gibraltar myself. Um, so I'm just moving this up so you can see that there indeed is an army in Spain, South Coast, it looks like. The Italian is getting ready to have a position against France. Uh, France is in, a, in an EF with me, um, but I've also, um, you know, made overtures to Italy. Uh, looks like Italy and Austria are, are pretty good right now. He's moving out from the Austrian front. But maybe Turkey now is going to get involved. Um, maybe Austria has, has pitched him. A plan to keep him in the game. So the the puzzle for today is really to to say what do you build here as England, um, given the relationships I've just established. And yeah, you can see my position. The the German is going to have to remove too, so keep that in mind. Um, Germans, you know, probably if he wants to have play in this game, he has to keep. Uh, the army in, in Berlin and and probably ask uh, me for help and maybe I I could uh, I could use this help um, in some fashion if I want to use my resources elsewhere so uh, if he isn't on for that I may just shift my position um, you know into the Baltic here and go ahead and take Berlin myself. So I think, if anything, uh, I, I definitely want to get another army onto the mainland here. I'm attacking Germany, I'm allied with France, so I don't need to immediately attack France or attack Russia, the both are on side with me. So I really actually have a dream position, it's just about can I get myself into a, uh, a position where I can get to 18. Uh, so I want to make sure I maintain the right pace here and keep my relationship strong so with that in mind what are you going to build that's the puzzle for today uh, that's another episode of daily diplomacy uh, i do want to say thank you to all of you who have supported what i'm doing here i uh, just really love diplomacy and think more people should play it whether that's online or face to face uh, it's really a game that's going to test uh, who you are as a human being um, and develop a lot of communication skills uh, along the way and uh, if you do want to support me, the easiest way to do that is just to share some of these videos with your friends, um, especially new players who so are trying to get into your clubs. Uh, or go ahead and support my, uh, my book. That's leanpub.com slash diplomacy. You can also just get a free version of that at diplomacybook.com, although that is quite a bit uh, condensed version of, of what I'm sharing in the kind of stylized diplomacy guide, which you can find at... Um, leanpub.com slash diplomacy. You'll, you'll find all of that in the comments. So um, I would love your support on that. And I'll see you in the next episode of Daily Diplomacy. See you soon. Cheers.